All right, for those of you who don't know, the Picard Season 2 trailer just dropped onto my lap, and I'm about to check it out. So if y'all don't mind, I'm going to put on my headphones, my old-fashioned headphones, circa 21st century, and let's rock and roll. Okay, we're back on the vineyard. What the hell is that badge? Do you see that badge? Okay. What did I say? The teaser. I saw the teaser and I said it better not be time travel shit. Go back and look at the video. Did I not say that? What is this? Uh, uh, she just didn't want to wear the prosthetic anymore. I know what to do. That's it? Oh, for God's sake, dude. Oh my god. We're doing time travel. Are you joking me right now? God dang it. God dang it, I might flip this table. I hate time travel shit. I'm tired of it. I don't want to see any more. We're doing time travel because we can't get the we can't get base Star Trek correct. Like, my dude, we can't even get normal Star Trek. How can we do alternate timelines Q shit? This, this, this reminds me, like, uh, uh, we, uh, had the Mirror Universe in Discovery, and that was written a little bit better than the Prime Universe, Prime Universe. I just, I don't, maybe these people making this show, they can't actually write normal Star Trek. They don't know how. They don't know how to write virtuous characters. They don't know how to write heroes. So they have to keep screwing it up and go into different timelines and go into the mirror universe and having Q mess up the timeline so that they can have an excuse to write characters that are bad. That's all I'm getting out of this. Maybe I'm jumping the gun, but they did say time was broken. And did I not say that it sounded like time travel crap in the way back in the teaser? I think I said something like that. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong. Mm -mm. Okay, um, is this going to be a little time travel? Are we going back in time? Are we just going to do some Q shenanigans? Is Q just going to, are we just going to do the episode Tapestry again? Is that what we're doing here? Uh, I don't want to be messing around with time right now because I got to review this garbage, okay? I thought Picard Season 1 was worse than Discovery. Honestly, I thought Picard Season 1 was worse than Discovery Season 3. Here we are again. So I know this is going to be a short video, but uh, we just checked out Picard. Um, in other news, we revealed the character names for um, Star Trek Prodigy. Uh, one of the characters' name is Jankum, which, if you know your internet history from the from the 21st century, uh, you know that ha that word has some strange history to it. A little bit unfortunate, but that's beside the point. Um, main thing is that this Picard trailer did not give me hope. Um, we are not getting normal Star Trek, and we're probably going to go a whole season without seeing actual normal Starfleet ships in operation. God dang it. 
if you're gonna, if you want to do the mirror universe again, just do it. But as far as I'm concerned, we're doing mirror shit twice because we're going on a path not taken. Whatever. Give me a break. Uh, this is Mark signing out. See you guys in the next video. See you guys when the shows drop, when Lower Decks and Picard drop, and I have to review that shit. Um, maybe you'll have more fun watching me review it than I will actually watching it, but we'll wait and see on that. So long.